Hello and welcome guys to yet another video of Scroll Gameplay's Test of Vengeance. Now I'm continuing my crusade on Fisher Dungeons and trying to complete them on Purest or by getting the Purest badge. Um, Vicious Steel is what I'm trying next. Um, I'm going to use one of these two. Berserker because of obvious reasons. Magic Resist. Assassin because killing enemies with death protections in one hit is just nice. So I'm I'm gonna go for the assassin, I think. Um, <laughs> I think that Pindar is a great, great or god for this particular dungeon, but I can't prep things because of the purist. So I'm just gonna hope RNG is gonna play its part, I guess. Other than that, I'm just gonna go elf, I think. Elf, assassin, and uh, yeah, I'm gonna be a sassy assassin. I don't even, you know? I don't even. Okay, this must mean something for me. Dracul. Doesn't really help me out now, does he? Let me think. Sanguine, blood hunger, blood shield. It could help me. I kind of want to spam spells though. I kind of want like Mystera or Binlor. <laughs> Binlor because of magic resistance, isn't actually. And because access to. Um, piss off. I could go fireballs instead of piss off though. Then I get resistances from Dracula as well. It's a thing. It's a um, way to go down. And it's just one altar left, so I don't know which it is. Where is it? Oh, yes, sir. I'm grabbing the balance dagger. Using all the crutches right now, and uh, it really sucks not being an orc right now or a human to boost my damage to be able to one shot these guys. Um, would be really helpful. I'm just sort of holding out my hopes for a damage boosting item. And there's Yahora. All right. Yahora means more mana. She means one spike level, and that's good. But not having any resistances against a level which has a ton of, I think it's a ton of magicians and two magic bosses means magic resistances. My resistance is just, just king. Although, I won't be taking that much damage because I'm chugging spells. At least I one of them. So, um. I don't know. Increasing my HP is also another way to go. So, I'm. I'm kinda sucks not, actually. Because I've gotten a lot of piety when I'm exploring this and using this. Oh well, oh well. 45, it's a lot. Plate mail. Oh yeah, I completely forgot about the thing that I can do here. I can. I got weakened now, which hurts a lot. But I, I completely forgot about this. It's still not enough. Fuck you know. Really? 
Y ve, que se puede gestionar. Yo, I, I can one shot them. I mean, two shot them, that's the word. That's not really what I'm going for, though. How about you then? It's just not enough. I can be cursed, that doesn't matter. Not when I don't have any resistances now. <laughs> the damage is not up, but it should be to be able to pull off the strategy. As you can see, it's just not where it should be. And corroded. I really want to get that pirate in it. There we are. Don't need to worry about that anymore. I can one shot all these guys now, that's, that's kind of cool, but I got the balance back. So let's try and. It's plus four, so it's, it's a lot more than. No, plus two. So it's a lot more than, than just one more. You know, we double the amount of, of having to slow the enemies, but. Getting both of them would be the best. But I'm not um, I'm not an orc. I can't really do that, so let's just not let's stop pretending, eh? Just go for it. Curses, curses sucks. Can I kill you in two hits if I do this? Easily. I'm just gonna do this now because Okay, next. You happened happen to do to do the as the things to me. A lot of curses, but I don't care. Not one bit. Tell you, not one bit. That might be a really good dungeon, sub dungeon, if it gives me what I want. Could oh, it's I think it's gold and then it's zombies. Interesting, interesting indeed. And a lot of black space, which is pretty invaluable in this game. Fireball rain, not what I wanted. It makes me a sad, sad panda. I was talking about getting a lot more mana. At this point, it doesn't really help me out that much, but it seems like it's gonna be fireballs. Level threes. That's new. Semi efficient. Okay, that didn't really do. Still has six. Just like that. HP. How is that gonna? Is that gonna help me kill a super high level enemy? Presumably not. Because I don't want to fight these guys high level. I want to fight these guys though at high level, and they deal just a ton of damage. And they seem to be the only guys that I want to fight actually, except for the golems, and I can't see any golems. Damn it. Okay, 
fireballs are going to be strong by getting the the ring. That's taking more damage at this point, and 10 at level 10. That's kind of cool, I guess. Uh, what's level 3? This is level 3. You can't poison him, which means this is just a chore and a bore. But if I use these, then he's going to go down easily. Which means I can essentially do the same thing over and over again with the these guys, yeah. Oh shit, I don't get to first strike him because I have the explore behind him. I, that can be changed by doing this. Now suddenly, oh. There we go. Was it worth it? I don't know. What a cool trick though. I find. And I should not do this now. Never mind. Who's next? Eh? Is he? Maybe not. Or maybe. How much experience is it going to give me? I just can't tank this guy, so I need to just fight the. Oh yeah, now I see what, what I can do. I can first strike at the end and then use just a ton of this and this before that. Yes. And then that makes my HP a lot more valuable. Why no fighting? Here I come. Right? Right. And you want to explore the same stats, not going to be grabbed without using this. The hard to reach spots. Just like these. I don't need to have HP for the fight because I'm just going to first strike your face. That is perfect! And I can do the exact same thing to the level 9 there. Please fuck off. Wish I had 18 though. 18 mana, that is. Close, but no cigar. Obviously, fights that don't involve Athletic is harder than it could be for this guy, but as you just saw in the previous fight, it's not still not impossible if you have something else up your sleeve. Oh, it's pretty darn close. Yeah, if I just converted this one prior to this, then it would have worked. But I didn't, so I lost a lot of potential mana or easy things. It's four damage. Is this going to give me enough damage? I don't think so. This one would have done the same sort of thing, would have won. But I was a scrub and I messed up, and now I have to pay the price for that. So I can pick up this and we just heal up and or I can pick up. Yeah, I'm probably gonna pick up this I think. And then just get enough to cast this and then voila. Worked not as efficient as it could have been, but oh well, I can't take a single hair here, I can basically do the same procedures on his face but do I want to? I think I do Dragon Soul would have been perfect here cool I 
thinking about saving up for the um, Chaos Avatar. Bloody Sigil, can we just barely afford it? That might be a purchase and convert. Have a bunch of popcorn, which is nice. Bunch of popcorn plus Chaos Avatar plus Assassin, I mean uh, Elf, huge mana bar. Yeah, that's, that's a lot of fun. And, you know, this guy just kills everything in one hit if they are lower level than he is. So, maximizing the piety, I mean, the experience now by doing this might be wasting a bit of resources though okay so let's evaluate can we in i can't remember the zombies at which level they are if they are a specific level or if they're based on the level i am because if if they're not based on the level i am then i should just go there when i'm a high level and just insta kill them by swift hand if not then i should go now um, and i just don't know would like to have this and this but i don't think i'll be able to afford it so that's that and the fight i want to do this fight first because he's gonna put corros corrosion on me that's gonna make this fight harder however not able to tank a single hit makes it kind of hard starting this fight except freezing fireballs he's an undead so he doesn't get apple sect like this guy does apple sect doesn't does that increase the damage of the burn grasses i i have always thought that it doesn't but I'm not 100% sure. Actually. I've completely forgotten about the bounce dagger. Which is a bad thing. But right now it's just retaliating, weakening both enemies. Oh yeah, this guy. This guy works. I could now go for a test. So, um, 69 HP if I do it now, and now he takes 69 damage as well. So, it does not affect, and I have an exploit behind him. So, uh, I mean, around him. That didn't work. Kill him anyway. Alright. Nope, I saw if. No, and this wall can't reach that. No bin in sight. Crimea River. Alright. Still no interesting level sixes. Rather just kill him one hit later on. So I guess it's time. Heal up. Like that. And then use everything I can on his oh, he blinks as well. well that's not a problem and you know what I'm gonna use my words of power here because um, I'm not gonna reach this black space ever and I'm really glad I had a battle my stream right now because that's making it a lot more efficient you might jump around all you want, it's not gonna save you from the inevitable doom that awaits you. You should be so cocky, I'm probably gonna lose this. So, karma, in it. Okay, I'm kind of hesitant here. It's not feeling. I'm not feeling super confident about this, but let's just. I mean, this this other fight is is pretty tough. 
and it requires a lot of resources. So, um, you know. Okay, so think this through, right? Probably want to use my my gold for purchasing it. Can I even purchase? Yes, I can afford it. After having hit this guy a few times, I should probably get the corrosion wipe. I need to save the gold, and I can't purchase this one. Convert it, even though it would be kind of nice. But do I need all of this? I'm thinking yes. Let's kill the highest level enemies I can, so I leave the amount of popcorn for the burn special tick on this guy. But getting the most experience out of the enemies. Yeah, it's not going too good. This. Well, kind of. Kind of working out. Okay, am I? It blocked the way there, and that kind of sucks. And I don't want to be cursed. Doesn't really matter that much. Okay, I could have hit him once, but it doesn't really do all much more damage than this, as you can tell. So I might as well just. Took the curse away. And it's still not ready. What can I do? Kill things? Sure. Explore. Don't want to do that. Okay, there we go. Somehow it gave me. Okay. Whatever. I just have to use it one more time, then I should I don't know how that works. It's really high HP that this guy has. It's proving to be pretty hard. Oh yeah, damn it. I didn't think about that. This one wiped my buffs. I could have come uh, desecrated. Um, Earth Mother before clicking Chaos Avatar. That would have given me 30 more piety, which would allow me to get one of these or convert to another god or whatever. Sanguine would have been great, I think, at this point. I'm not going to use this, really. I should have just converted it earlier. Um, oh well. I can kill everything on screen now. Apart from the little, um, what's their faces? Nice, yes. Still not gonna do it, I think. Yeah, that's not enough. That means zombie time. I do believe so. They are level 9. Fuck. Uh, okay. Well, if I can kill a single one. Nope, I can't kill a single one. Fucking hell. Okay. Tell you what, I want to skip these enemies. Can I please skip the enemies? No. Not gonna have them. Fine. I could just do this and then do it again. That was super inefficient, and he's healed up a bunch, and it's just not gonna work anymore. Oh, I got the gold though, that's kinda cool. 
I should definitely just have cell board it boom 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 multiple times instead of doing all the loads of powers or something. I don't know. Something like that. Oh, I retaliate. Okay, desperate last attempt here. Ah, uh, just see what I'm gonna do. But things, things matter. That's how it works. Pushes that one, so I don't forget about it, and then just. Try sword. Don't have enough room for it, mate. Don't have enough room. I have the combination here of loads of power and sanguine and a lot of black space. That means I am able to chug a lot of fireball for this guy, which is nice and all. But that's only if I kill this guy. I can start doing that. So. How to go about, eh? Well, increasing my damage could kind of help because I get to first strike his face. It's a thing. It's a thing. This one? I don't care about it anymore. Away it goes. Okay, didn't really give me any more room though because um, it's more easier. There we go. Got enough room for the Chai Sword. And I am now Torog's disciple. Help me kill this guy. How to go about? I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna kill him normally. Well, this is a way. I'm sure. Oh yeah, no, no, not that way. <laughs> Definitely not that way. Curse doesn't matter because they full damage anyway. I might as well just do that. And holy crap, he takes my HP just vanishes into thin air, and there's not. A f this won't change anything. How incredibly annoying this is. How like infuriating and stupid this is. I don't even know what I was trying there. It's not like I'm gonna dodge as an assassin. I can't use it again either. But that's a good best I can do it, but then there's a risk involved. I don't like risks, do I? Can't do it a single time. Let alone this guy. Let alone kill that guy. He doesn't like me doing this, but I have indulgence. Getting close. That much is clear. But could have converted the health potion actually. That would have maybe done the thing trick. Twenty fucking five. Lovely. Oh, lovely. Oh, right. Okay, so I'm pretty darn strong at this point with the huge health bar and everything here, so. I mean, mana bar. The 
if you want to load that, yeah. Oh yeah, I can kill this guy, just... Oh, he doesn't like it. Oh, he did not like that. Oh. Well, fuck it, I'm gonna level up and I'm gonna be happy, happy. As hell, like that. As far as I'm concerned, Dracula can just sort of. I guess the thing is leveling up or. Nah, I didn't level up. But I'm gonna level up on him anyway. So I don't really know how efficient any of this was, but. There we go. Okay, so, <clears throat> don't have the popcorn, which is helping out with um, removing his death protections, which needs to be done before starting the actual fight. And um, I don't deal that much more damage physically than this. So I probably want to save my health for using lots of power. And I'm thinking of doing this. And if I use body power, will he lose his tiles? I'm thinking it will. I'm thinking it will. Let's have a test. It doesn't. Okay, so I'm gonna heal up. He just needs one tile, that's all I need. Doesn't need to be. Alright, apparently there's no more left for me to grab, so this one, away it goes. Alright, for desperate moments I could desecrate this, but right now, um, I'm going to try my best with what I've got. That could be kind of interesting, this plate now. Could actually prove very useful indeed. Picked up for the end, right? Something like that. Forty-seven. Which is 172. Yeah, it does deal quite a bit more damage, and I have Sanguine left, so I might as well. Yeah, I have just one layer of Sanguine, don't I? That's not a lot. It's really not a lot. Not a lot of health. At this point, damage is irrelevant because he. But mana is not, because amount of times cast is more valuable now than the damage done. Same goes for this, don't really need it, so I could essentially remove it, but it's not gonna help out, so I might as well just hang on to it because it looks pretty or something. You know, um, 46 is starting to do a lot less damage, which is really good for me. But it's nowhere near close to where I need him to be, as you guys can tell. That brings in what exactly? Kill him. I'm not gonna explore, he's still poisoned. And eight tiles is not an awful lot, so I could have poisoned him a lot more and then actually maybe use him, but <sighs> yeah, I could have done that. Could definitely have done that. However, I can 
allow him to heal as well. It's not really super bad as long as he doesn't heal over this. Right? Right. We'll save the attacks for the very end. And just go go straight for it at the end. That's what I'm going for. Yeah. Still not enough for him to be able to. And it's not doing any damage to me right now because of the damage reduction I have. But it's gonna stack up a lot of corrosions and then it might become semi difficult for me. But let's just go ham. See how it goes, eh? It's the worst that could happen. No problem at all. I'm not entirely sure how it works, but 42 corrosions and 3 damage equals 45. And I just have 20 damage reduction. So I don't really know how it works. It seems to be somewhat bugged. Because I've seen this happen before as well. But I'm not complaining though. This is something about the order of things. How he first attacks and then he... I, I don't know. I don't really don't know, but I won. Cursed assassin. Don't really feel like I should have won that, but I did. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. Um, just this one left. Apart from the obvious issue gauntlets um, of the purest vicious ones, so it's kind of cool. See you guys around. Bye.